This is you know, be this an, could be this could be a grand final at any premier event over the last three years, and, easily. And what's really and this is just to get on the winner side for top eight. And the, and the crazy thing about this though is that throughout their history, even before Knuckle Doo was Knuckle Doo, even yeah. before he became one of the greatest in the world, he always seemed to have infiltrations number. He beat him in Street Fighter Four at like. There was one Evo that I think he beat him at, and then he beat him at a couple of other Street Fighter IVs, uh, premiere events as well. He's always just kind of had an understanding okay, of what Evo wants to do. Okay, this is an interesting choice. So, so I know he has been looking at Kami as a character. Oh, really? Yep, I know he's been looking at Kami as a character. I saw him bring it out in a couple of uh, money matches and casual matches yesterday evening uh, and on Friday night as well. Yeah, I mean, Mana can fight Guile pretty well and Third can keep well. Mika out a little bit decently. I'm trying to figure out what it is about this one. Yeah, that's what, that's what he's looking for. Yeah, he just wants to get in. <laughs> he wants the drill whip punish to the whip buttons, basically, because that is a fast, quick, straight attack that requires no charge timing. It's difficult for Manat to deal with the air approach as well. She hasn't got the greatest anti-airs in the world. The EX air throw is really reliable, and the hard kick is, is great as well if you get the counter hit, but Ooh, just no. generally, Difficult for her to cover up, but... Yeah, and a little bit of unfamiliarity wow, from Knuckle Wow, just goes <laughs> a hard read sweep and gets the crush counter this time. Ooh, was able to catch her out of the delay and spends the whole thing. Doesn't decide to save the second half of that and gets the cross-up. Infiltration probably thinking there's no way you're going to go for a cross-up and put yourself in the corner, but he did it. Oh, ooh. wow, the frame of... <laughs> Not able Still. to use those orbs at all when you're in block or hit stun, of course. You almost never see Manat die with orbs. Still floating, <laughs> exactly. And it looks like Infiltration's having trouble dealing with this Kami style that Knuckle Dude has. And obviously, he's, he's going to have an interesting approach to it. He's just using it as a tool. He's not yep. maining Kami. He's going to do a... some unorthodox things exactly. with Exactly, and that can be difficult. You can think you know the matchup, but you play someone who's literally using it as a tool for a job. Yeah, I call that the Chris G factor. You mm. always think Chris G is one of the strongest players because he does everything kind of in his own style. And that's what Knuckle Dude was doing with this yeah. character. Now going for the anti-air, even off the train! Oh no. But he missed the rest of the juggle. That's such a got powerful the critical tool. Art as well. Still got one more orb, gonna use that to make the slide. Very safe. likely you'll be able to get uh, another V-trigger back though. Okay, Knuckle Dude getting in there for the throw in. Already you know, this is there. one of the nice things about Kami in this matchup versus Manas. The walk speed. The yes, the walk speed. speed's great as well. Mm, you can definitely see it's a good tool. Gotta watch out for ooh. Gotta watch out for V-trigger drill right now. That is such a dangerous thing. You gotta be careful throwing out those buttons like that. Oh, and he just oh, oh! No, and he missed the critical arc! Straight into the critical arc. Oh no. That was supposed to be a critical art from Knuckle Dude. Drops it, unfortunately. Oh. Backdashes and gets air reset. Now you have to take all of these orbs. Yeah, you got it. But you know what? Infiltration, I think. Oh, that was sick! Oh! Infiltration obliged to what Knuckle Dude wanted so too quickly. He We've spent those seen orbs infiltration in the, in the get really comfortable. Jump at people and either use the drill or the mm -hmm. float over cross up with the orb release as a mix up. <laughs> that doesn't work if you got the DP stopped. And the critical art, critical art closed out the round as well. 1 0. And the Evo Japan champion. These are definitely two of the Street Fighter V prodigies, I'd say. You know, alongside Punk. Mm -hmm. They both had very dominating periods in the early years uh, of this game. Yeah, in terms of just uh, eras of domination, those three are definitely in the lead. Nice. nice. Gets the yes, side yes. switch. Yeah, very important. <laughs> side, side switch of her own. own. Yep. One of the best V reversals in the game, easily. Uh, <laughs> very punishable, though. Very punishable. I wouldn't say it's very punishable, sir. <laughs> Not as much as it should be, anyway. We'll save that one for afterwards. Yes. <laughs> I'm biased a little bit. <laughs> we all know that. <laughs> the infiltration right now doing a good job keeping... Oh! oh good reaction so ready. Right there. Yeah. Infiltration is so ready for things that he shouldn't humanly be that ready for. I know she doesn't have to do that that early as an anti-air, mm -hmm. but wow, that what a call out that was. Incredible reactions. Knuckle Doom not even able to activate there. Died with full V-Gage. 
I really like Knuckle Dew's spacing as well. He's really aware of the range at which to stand, so he's just outside of that orb. And it's interesting because, he, okay, even though, I was about to say, even though he hasn't really had that whip punish with the drill versus the standing heavy punch, yeah. Infiltration knows that's something he's looking for, so it changed the way Infiltration wanted to play neutral. Yeah, showing that sort of stuff early on is really important because, as you said, it does change the way your oh, opponent plays. Oh, that's a stun. She's got one bar right now. Is this going to kill? No. Not quite. Just misses oh. it, but again, second time we've seen Every him die with orbs. In the corner? Infiltration is eating a lot of this stuff. The crossover light kick, the cannon strike. I'm really surprised to see it getting opened up this much. Like I said, it's weird. Infiltration always seems to have trouble fighting against Knuckle Dew. Mm. It's like something about Knuckle Dew's play style that just counters Infiltration. And yeah, as we mentioned, Infiltration winning a bunch of events in a row, including final round as well. Yeah, he's you definitely know. on a roll right now. And Knuckle Dew was trying to end that roll. Gets the three hit light confirm off the counter hit into the throw in the corner. Guess what? One more. Co okay, now you're in trouble. You're throw in a lot of trouble. Puts combo. himself finally blocks the cross up light kick. Mm, Knuckle Dew not respecting Mana at all. Standing medium I kick. I like that. Yeah, this is kind of what I was hoping Infiltration would do earlier. Save the orbs a little bit in terms of danger because he's going to be able to confirm into the critical art right that here. He's not going to kill. He's still on all left, I think. Oh, it might be. No, it's not. Still alive. Got to watch out for that. Don't throw. Oh, my God. That could have been a raw V trigger and that would have, or raw critical art and that would have been death. And Knuckle is just not phased at all by that orb. Mm. A little the too close, yeah. You norm um, you'd normally see players just creep forward, crouch block, Menard creep forward, crouch wins. block with that orb out. Knuckle Dude was happily walking backwards and forwards. <laughs> I'm really surprised Knuckle Dude didn't just Daring. go for an EX uppercut after that. <laughs> Cause, uh, and that, again, right there shows a little bit of character unfamiliarity, mainly because at that height, Round Knuckle Dude wasn't quite aware that he was not going to yes. be able to have the positive uh, frames nice. on that. Punish on the whip again. Ooh. Back throw this time. Let's see if Infiltration can alter his defense. Oh, straight into the cannon strike. Relentless forward momentum here. Oh, Woo! what an uppercut reaction. Talk about the reaction to Infiltration. Knuckle do. And unfortunately, the Infiltration dropped his Manat combo as well. A little bit yeah, tough. To time I don't think anyone's got those combos down 100%, yeah. even Sako. It's tough to time the, the post activation because you have to attack with the medium punch as well as negative edge it at the same time in order to make that combo work. It's really tough to time. You can't match, basically. The three button buffer is not going to help you in that situation. The three frame buffer, I should say. Well, has unfortunately, to that. no yeah. resources. He has. To, oh, he's just going to say, had to respect that V trigger. The cannon strike is on deck. No DP on the jump back. Could have caught that. Yeah. So Knuckle now says, you, oh! "Oh, that was supposed to be a drill." It's unfortunate. But watch out. He's got the EX bar. Well, he tries to use it. Oh, oh what? Oh, Another what? one? Oh! He went for the raw wow. uppercut again, and this is where in. Where Knuckle Dew can cause infiltration fits. There's no reason to do that. And as much as you know, we talk about Kazunoko being crazy and whatever, and all that stuff, that reputation that he has, Knuckle Dew has that in him, but he brings it out in the craziest situations. Absolutely. I mean, we saw him against Problem X with a call out on the normal flash kicks that really right. saved his life. I was talking to Justin Wong earlier as well. He was telling me, listen, you have the you have the character matchup, but the player matchup is just as important, and it's clear mm -hmm. here that Knuckle Dew. Definitely is comfortable in the player matchup. Well, Infiltration spending all of his meter on that anti-air. Oh, I definitely think it's worthwhile using that meter as well. She gets Oki off of it, and her me meter build is pretty significant mm -hmm. as well. Especially when uh, Do is going to allow Infiltration to throw out these orbs. Okay, we've got that V-trigger activation now. Scary time. Oh, he blocked just in time. Oh, the oh. range on that. Jump. Hard kick is incredible. No yeah. hoops. Yep. That has got an enormous hitbox <laughs> on it. So it's good. crazy. It's so good. Marvel-esque hitbox. 
I was wondering when I saw that move announced how effective it would be and how big the explosion would be. And I saw that it hit Crouchers from a screen away like yeah. that, and I was like, whoa, there we go. See there, Knuckle do learning on oh, the fly time there. Tries to anti -air. The oh, light the shimmy. shimmy, but no cancel didn't commit to it. Oh! That time he does. Oh, beautiful defensive oh, jump back. Oh, and it's too far! No. It's too far! So that's gonna give Knuckle Doo not just the combo, but the knockdown and the pressure. Again, puts himself in the corner. Knuckle Doo has not been scared to do that at all. Okay. Infiltration, spending all the orbs now. Only has the two air orbs. Yep. And you can see. Now, it. Infiltration is the one with the four momentum and the offensive mindset. Yeah, one of the things I like the most about Infiltration is his movement. He's so good at using the drills. So good at using the range on that horizontal uh, jump roundhouse. Ooh, got oh, got him out of the air. Yeah, He's gonna combo time, into the EX orbs. Yeah, that time he uses Ooh, the Ooh, what? He didn't get far away enough? Knuckle 2 is able to throw and have the V trigger activated! Oh, oh, not, not, not quite enough! Just a tiny bit left. One more touch. Watch out for the orb toss. Yeah, the orb toss can definitely get EX drilled and that would end the round. That's why you see Knuckle 2 crouching. He's ready to throw that out. Oh, and that's why Infiltration dashes a full screen away to throw the orb. He knows oh. it's coming! Push counter! No! Oh, there, it there, is. there it is! And Knuckle Doo books his place in winner's side of top eight. He called it out. He had to be wary of that EX spiral arrow. He'd shown both of the players, to be fair, had shown their reactions were on point. Knuckle yeah, Doo. that was a situation right there. Infiltration should not have risked that orb toss. He should have just kept the orb in hand been the threat and dared Knuckle Dude to move forward yeah. into the he danger had 20 area.